Good morning, good day, good afternoon, good night. Whenever you're watching this brown sugar latte, let's get into it, y'all. The scent notes goes as follows. Freshly roasted coffee, froth, milk, sugar, pralines. That sugar praline is, pralines are made out of brown sugar. So that's what your brown sugar is picking up. And is it true to the scent? That's going to be a yes. I've, I've said this from the beginning, whipped coffee just doesn't do it for me. Bath and Body Works got rid of Paris Cafe, and that is the wrong move. Um, coffee scented candles, y'all. You don't have to be into coffee, but this is how you reset the scent notes in your home. The same thing when I worked at Sephora, I kept coffee beans in my pocket. You're going to need that because you're dealing with heavy scents all day, especially if you have wallflowers and room sprays and things like that. This is just the way to go. Now, look at the thick LX wicks in here. Remember the rule with the LX wicks. They're thicker. So you want to stick to your four-hour burn time because your candle will burn out faster versus um, eco wicks or your core wicks that burns a little slower, right? But let's get into the vibe that she's giving. She is giving what it's supposed to give. She is giving, I just walked up into Starbucks with that freshly roasted coffee. It's giving me that Kona coffee. It's giving me that bougie girl coffee like me. It's giving me that fresh French press Pikes roast like me. She is not Dunkin' Donuts. Okay. Dunkin' is for the ghetto, okay? Dunkin' is going to be that whipped coffee that Bath & Body Works gave us. She is going to be your Starbucks girl. She has on her flat knee-high boots for the fall. She has a cashmere scarf around her shoulder. She has on her oversized shades. She has her venti size Pikes Roast in her hand with a little bit of steam vanilla sweet cream. And we're going to run out errands for the day, a.k.a. Hobby Lobby, Target, Sephora, and every place else we're supposed to be. How does she get? Do I grade it a 10? I give it even a 12. Stepping across my bedroom door, my beauty room, the scent is full. That coffee note, that sweet note, it filled the room, y'all. On a warmer, she's going to blow you away. Now, my apartment is L-shaped. The living room, dining room, kitchen runs together, and then it turns into an L-shaped, two back bedrooms. I'm going to tell you what I did. Best trio. Put this by the front room table. Caramel brulee latte on the kitchen counter, and then white caramel cold brew in the back bedroom. And I felt like I opened up my laptop, and I'm chilling at Starbucks for the day, and don't nobody bother me. I'm in my zone. If you check my IG, you know I'm a coffee lover. I'm a bougie coffee girl. I can make anything work, but y'all y'all know Duncan be having me struggling. But this right here, oh, we Starbucks. We bougie girls down at Starbucks. A 10, a solid 10. It gets no better. Candle day, hoard worthy, I'm telling you. This would even go good with the toasted coconut mocha from last year. I know it would. But I don't want to burn mine because I only have one. I may break down and get one from a reseller on eBay because this combination right here, right here, right here is everything. So get y'all bougie girl swag on. Get y'all bougie girl coffee swag on because she is worth having. And like I said, whip coffee, baby, that's Duncan. We, we ain't got time for that. But think about this review. Think about coffee. Think about the fall, football, all of that. She's giving. And I'm going to see y'all on the next video.